Hey, what's going on guys? Be Flatten here with a brand new video today. Today we're covering about patch 1.2.2, February 2nd, 2023 for Temtem. Now this is going to be a smaller patch than normal, but it's still a patch nonetheless, so let's go ahead and see what we got. Uh, important notice, we've taken this chance to resynchronize the status of the Tempedia and the Kudos. This should improve and hopefully eradicate any discrepancy between the Kudos that involve capturing Tems and Lumas and your actual Tempedia number. This is an issue we've had for a while, so please let us know if you experience any bug with it. Improvements, we've improved the um, uh, issues with crashes on the Switch. Most of the Switch crashes are due to memory issues. Uh, crashes will happen from time to time, but now we've died deep into the issue. We will be carrying out more optimization in future patches to improve even more. We've made some improvements and changes to the die system. We've added a confirmation pop-up when trying to apply a die. We've added a confirmation pop-up when trying to remove a die. Players cannot use the same die twice in the same slot of a cosmetic. A preview of the dies will now be shown in the Tamer Pass UI and Premium Store UI. We have added a new label to dies in the Tamer Pass UI and Premium Store UI to clarify their one-time use. Dies were a source of a lot of community feedback and unrest with these changes. We hope this makes the experience easier to navigate. We have reworked Stale's animations so they look better and our little dude has more prep in his step. Nice. Uh, the dulcimer instrument now has a nice, uh, a, a new texture. A little bit of PvE balancing. Stowaway no longer has a tem with the straw shield gear in the arch tamer pool. Interesting. Um, we have reduced co-op bonuses from 20% to 15%. While Amishi and Yukama no longer have water blade in their move pool, following uh, the changes made to these tems in 1.1 or 1.2.1, sorry. Fix the soft lock when defeating the Digilair boss. That's happened for quite a while now. Fix the case where players could get stuck in a black screen after a battle in some places, like the high below. Fix the chat automatically swapping to local tab when entering buildings or leaving combat. Nice. Fix the Tamer Pass weekly challenge about buying or selling at the trade house for a value of 10k pensions that cannot be completed by before by buying before the fix. Fix that Temtem on the 4th, 5th, and 6th slot of a player's squad were receiving XP and TVs to the co-op bonus, even when that Tem had Ignoramus Cloak equipped. Fix not being able to clear the notifications that were set manually by Clear All Notifications button. Cosmetics menu not working properly if there was an empty row at the end. Tahani having two Temtem with Sweatband. The props of emotes not being displayed in the shop preview. Fix the emote here ye when not, uh, not playing when being used. Fix the settings UI overlapping with the ranked UI that appears after a ranked match of a player had settings open when their opponent conceded. Club banner colors are being changed just by hovering the icons. Fix that when changing cosmetics. The new one was uh, keeping the old one's dye colors. Uh, description of technique lifeful sap so that it explains that it gives 5 turns of regen. Description of technique hallucination showing the wrong status in the, in the uh, description. Change the name of the magma eruption seal to something that better reflects the seal animation. Fix the subscribe prompt button in the sections of the trade house where it doesn't have functionality. Fix the typo in the title surfer folk in English. Fix some localization bugs and dialogues with NPCs and Portuguese. Fix level numbers overlapping the level text when uh, playing in French or Chinese. Fix that the ready for picnic table furniture was not localized in English. So it looks like there was just a bunch of... Uh, fixes and patches and things like that uh the balance of the co-op and uh, the straw shield is interesting the biggest one is probably the kudos and the switch crashes so this is going to be a huge bug fix kind of uh patch rather than a balance patch which is also really really acceptable and fine i hope you guys enjoy this and i hope uh switch players have a better experience let me know what you guys think my name is b flatten and i'm signing on out of here take care all laters